North Korea has conducted another projectile launch. It uh, landed in the East Sea, and the launch happened this Wednesday morning. This is the regime's 11th launch so far in 2019, the previous one happening 22 days ago, just over three weeks ago. Our Defence Ministry correspondent Kim Jion joins us on the line. Jion, what are we hearing right now? Well, Mark, South Korea's Joint Chief of Staff has confirmed that North Korea fired an unidentified projectile or projectiles into the East Sea on Wednesday. The launch was from eastern coastal county of Wonsan in North Korea's Kangwondo province. No other details were immediately known, including the number of projectiles fired, the projectiles type, flight range, and maximum altitude. Also, the exact time of the launch or launches were not officially released. Speaking of timing, the projectile launch comes a day after the North announced that it will hold working-level denuclearization talks with the U.S. this week, but it also comes a day after South Korea showcased its F-35A stealth fighter jets to the public for the first time at South Korea's 71st Armed Forces Day. And up until now, the North had heavily criticized Seoul's acquisition of the F-35A fighter jets, which can accurately hit their targets and return home while avoiding radar detection. It is believed that the North sees the F-35A fighter jets as one of Seoul's most threatening weapons. Meanwhile, citing Japan's chief cabinet secretary Yoshida Suga, Japan-based NHK reported that the recent launch were two ballistic missiles and that one of them landed outside Japan's exclusive economic zone in the East Sea and another one near Shimane Prefecture at around 7.10 and 7.27 this morning. That's all for now. I'll update you with the details as the story develops.